Hey, yo, check this out. This is Wayne Wonder, representing for Warwick Hill TV. You see the vision, don't it? See the vision, Warwick Hill TV. Keep it locked. Mm -hmm. As black as these are the issues that we need to address. We need to address. You understand what I said? You understand what I said? You understand what I said? You see? Set the bar for the youth, then. For the youth, then. Share, like, and subscribe, and stay tuned to the channel. Like, I don't know all this. All this. All this. All this. Yes, sir. Greetings once again, and my team of its Imperial Majesty Emperor Ayla Selassie the first. And all things that's good. You know, see, I want to answer welcome all viewers and subscribers. Viewers, if you like the content, subscribe. No, the video today is not going to be everybody's cup of tea, but it's one that I feel like I have to do anyway. You know, see, I'm an, is a lorry driver, a truck driver in Britain by profession. So, you know, I'll put it simple. See, and I'm an stop drive truck. Going almost two years now in Britain. See? So you see, the recent outcry and uproar about um, the shortage of Larry Driver in a prison and, I mean, in a Britain and things like that, and the country are going a crisis, food supply gets short and things like that. You know, say, it's so much, there's so much ignorance regarding the whole thing. You know, see it, and the leaders and the politicians, them, as far as this whole thing is concerned. Because after years now, you know, years, more than 10, 20 years, British drivers are complaining about the conditions. You know, see, one thing go up, you can be pretty certain keep going up, is the fees and the cars, operation cars and things like that. And you know, you know about the address driver wage. You know, you know about the address driver condition. I want the most precious some job in the country because the road, them tiny suck. And you not have no rights. You basically being told by your insurance, so watch ya. You liable to get the chance because you have a bigger vehicle and more likely to be the one who a push and a bully. Who's gonna push and bully and go against you? You know, see, that's the type of concept where everybody have regarding Larrys and Larry drivers. See, so you have to take extra caution. You have to take all the abuse, all the pressure, all the burden, everything will come with. The standard day to day living on the road monks, common people, new drivers, learner drivers, um, driving instructor, where choose to carry um, new drivers on the road, or learners on the road in a peak hours, and things like that. You have to contend with all of these things, you have to contend with the time frame where you set out for, for, for you know what I say? While the road is so unpredictable every day, every hour, you know, see it and all of them things that nobody factor in these pressures upon the driver. People just diminish the driver's um, presence, his efforts. You know, see, it is not recognized. You know, the whole operation of truck driving and delivery from point A to point B, the least consequential entity in the whole process is the driver. Believe you me. If the driver gets stuck on the road for the night with a million pounds of goods in the back of the lorry, all the driver gets for that night is 20 pounds for the whole night. 20 pounds can't even buy food. Worse for the night out. Sometimes it's snowing. Wickedly cold, bitterly cold and them thing there. You lock up inside a little box of truck cab there with the heater running. You understand? I circulate the same hot air over and over. The, the um, potency for your catch. A virus or some sort of ailment is quite high and things like that. You know, see, nobody pay attention to the cries and the concerns of drivers. Even now, today, when the country is in a crisis where it needs drivers, the government, the industry is not addressing or even suggesting, making mention of what drivers think, what the problems are. Britain have enough lorry driver. They are just not motivated to go there and drive lorry. It's easier to drive a van round town. You get basically the same wage and a lot more time in your local area. Because granted, you have some little errands to run and you drive around around to you, you, you same place in your area. You can pop in your lunchtime or upon your break and 
do some personal business as well. You can't do that when you're a lorry driver because of the best height, most height you're out of town. Even if you're the wrong town, you can't park your lorry anyway and go do nothing. You understand? You're fixing on that until you find specific spots for stop, for shop, and things like that. You know, see, it, it's a struggle, a very, one of the hardest, it's the worst um, um, driver condition on the road, a lorry driver. There is no amenities, no facilities set up, particularly for lorries and lorry drivers. Them can't park in here anyway. You know, see, more time you want shit, you want to use the toilet, you have to wait for all another two hours. You know, see, you know, see, no wonder when you park up at the lay by them from the, 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 the air road them and things like that, and you come out and try to go up in the bush, you take a piece when you look over there, beer shit, you see in a bag, buckle load, the buckle full, a piece and thing like that. It's atrocious over there. It's a cesspit. It's always nasty and stinky. You know, see, it did not get clean up either. You know, see, it. and of them think the drivers from all over the world have to come, who is special, particularly over Europe, have to come contend with in Britain. You see, the pay of the wage is crap. You know, see, the conditions are crap as well. See, as me I explain. You know, see, you know, see, the fool for get a breakfast for a driver is like twice way to the cars for a normal man inside a, inside a um, town area and thing like that. You know, see, because, the, again, location, you know, see, it's like a trap. It's not feasible with the liquid wage way I get. Everything for driver is most expensive, see, except for him wage. And up to this point, nobody has addressed the driver wage. Nobody has, has, has tried to say because motivate the driver back into work by giving more as a wage demand. Make could, me could set up something. Drivers, I'm not, I'm, truck drivers now get £100 a day for the best side. It's not certain to come home with a £100 in your pocket. Yet, him, it's worse. Agency drivers, those who drive through agencies, are brutalized. You know, see, traumatized and chopped all over the board and all over the way. You know, see, yeah. And truck drivers keep silent about it for the most part of it as well. A lot of them continue in you know, the same world. I don't know what's the benefit. A lot of them enjoy being away from them out home and them family. You know, see, them, and them escape that. So, them stick with it for weeks and and uh, and uh, look back at home. See, so regardless of what the wage that them I get is like, them I get paid for it, just stay home anyway because, you know, yeah. But it's a disgrace. Oh, these guys act ignorant. You know, see it and turn a blind eye to the real cause of the challenge where Britain have faced today and act like it is not a problem, like that another not a problem. Driver just drop off on the planet and gone, so. Eh? Wait, driver just disappear, so. COVID take all of the driver them the other day, yeah, most of the drivers. You know, see? Seduce back the driver them with the higher wage that them are demand from long, 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 long time. To me, as a truck driver, when you used to drive truck in a Jamaica, when you used to drive truck in Jamaica, I feel more, me feel more, um, me feel more in control, me feel more relevant. You know, see, your boss, the whole, um, you know, see, even your wage come like it, they're right up there with a policeman, a nurse, certain professional, certain, um, top level professional in a, in a, in a thing. You know, see, in a Britain, man, you just barely, it's like you're, you're in line, van driver feel better than you because them have a, a standard um, hour where them work most from 9 to 5 and them wear there. Seeing so between, between whenever till 9 o'clock, them have to mash up some errand after 9 o'clock. And during the daytime as, as well, them have a break period where they can take care of a certain other little business around town. Probably make two phone calls, pop into an appointment or something like that. You know, see, not that way for truck drivers. Truck drivers don't get to see dentists and things like that. You have, to can, you have to take off a whole day. See, you can't go, you know, see, the condition is not appealing. And the whole industry turned a blind eye and why like these things. 
They, they, the condition where them set on the hours again it can only work four and a half hour then you have to stop for your hour and then start back four and a half hour again and then anywhere that four and a half hour they de done at death so you have to stay till morning or till nine hour rest pass until you rest for nine hour you know see and after you start back again you have to stop after four and a half hour again and that's so it continue the cycle continue you know see is one bunch of stupidity when it exists nowhere else. You know, see, it is like the authority and everybody just set up all different kind of rules and regulation. And every rule and regulation of a different like entity that is we have to pay them for, for operate. You know, see, so it's very demoralizing. Everybody get every, get the most of everything out of the larry than the man who a captain the ship. You know, see, you have. The, the less authority round planning round anything concerning you just go in and steer like a robot and the wickedest thing you are the one who is responsible for f Larry Satnav is different from a car Satnav you know because the car can go certain place where the Larry can go and the Satnav of can tell say you the Satnav know where the Larry can go from where can go. so once you punch it I just take you the, 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 the right route the route where we were clear and have no blockage or anything like that. See, drivers are responsible for buying these things. One of the most expensive sat nav out there, you know. The last time you check a change that had bone for a Larry sat, um, sat nav. See, and a driver's them and ask, Where is your sat nav? Eh? You buy a truck for how much thousands of pounds and you couldn't have them install a Larry sat nav in it for 300 pounds. Extra. I mean, from the price where you pay, you could have asked that for as a, as a, as a, as a, you know me I say. You know, see, no consideration. And the roots are so messed up. You have some bridge where one ton too heavy. One ton, you two, you one ton too heavy for go across that bridge there. And all them way there. You one inch too high for go under that bridge there. And all them little thing there. You know, see, so you have to find your way all around all. You know, see it, and all them little thing there. Now the car sat nav down, and no know say you 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 too high for that bridge there. See, and all these things, and are you the driver? All of these expense is left up to, and you have, you, have, you know see it. It's not welcoming, man. And drivers should continue on a blackout on the industry until them come to reckoning. Say at thousands, sometimes millions of dollar. What a um, material drivers are pushed along the motorway. And he might get dust. Even the truck will burn more petrol than where the driver get rasta for, for, for carry it, go with spot to go. You see? You see? It's not acceptable, man. And, 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 and yeah. That's why the industry is dying. And the conservative government turn a blind eye and act like a, make this appeal like it's a, like a war the country ago. And it needs soldiers, it a recruit, it needs driver, it will go through every other process except addressing the real issue because it's people who are pointing it out. And in under the conservative government, they're not supposed to point out any faults of theirs. They're not supposed to do it. Even when it's admittedly a fault, they'll deny it and act like so well then. You know, you 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 you're rude and you're obnoxious just for suggest it. You out of you know see it. So they rather try you now. So they might um really look into the visa condition for drivers or visa um you know the demand for for, for a visa for coming so that them can attract foreign drivers rather than and the country have thousands of drivers who's unemployed. You know see. Was demoralized rather than get back these people in the country to work. Yeah, you go go out and outside rather than pay the people them with them. And them act like where the driver them gone where, 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 where they are Britain. We have we you know, check back this thing and see how much drivers in our Britain we have his GV license, but now apply themselves to the craft. You know, see it. What make you know, you know, you know, something? You know what? Uh, I go and leave you know, with that. Because this world is a crisis. You know, see it. You know, see it. I man give thanks. That's the fire. Share, like, and subscribe. You know, I don't want to share to 
white people sit down on it. Majority of the driver them white, you know. Majority driver white and them are struggling and suffer the consequence and them just sit down and quiet and just take it. Yes, so nurse or keep calm and carry on. You see? I like give thanks.